Cancer knocked me down, but not out. Now, I'm cancer free. The recovery, it's been tough. I'll need patience, a lot of humor. You can only keep talent down for so long. And support from friends and family. Over the last two years, I haven't played much golf, but there's no better place to get back in the game than on 66 courses in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. We're keeping score, but just teeing it up means I've already won. You're not gonna believe where this ball ended up. Join me on my journey to break par. This hole is beautiful and tough. You've got a force carry off the tee. A big oak tree guards the left side of the fairway and you've got a bunker right. Several tiers in this crane and it's protected by bunkers. So a birdie here is gonna be a big challenge. Let's see if I'm up to the task. So I'm on the fourth tee here at Heritage Club in beautiful Pauly's Island, South Carolina. Heritage Club is known for a couple things. Number one, it's always in great shape. Number two, the greens here are really challenging. But before we get to the green here at number four, we got to deal with this really tough tee shot. So I'm going to go with my three wood here. And the reason for that is it's a little easier for me to hit a draw. This hole sort of shapes from right to left. And, and I like being able to have the three wood and it also takes that bunker out of play. Come on, draw, baby. That's a six and a half yard draw right there. I measured it. I, I, if you look up on the interwebs, if you Google pure, you ain't had to put golf, just pure, a video of that three wood I just hit will probably pop up under pure, uh, or, or some of my friends call it pur, like tour, tour, PGA tour, PGA tour, pure. See how they rhyme, see what I did there? Anyway, that three wood was really good. All right, so here's the deal. I hit that three wood off the tee. I'm gonna have around 200 yards to the hole. I'm not even worried about where the hole is. This is one of the hardest holes on the golf course. From this far back, I'm just trying to put it middle of the grain. I'm gonna take a five iron. I got plenty of room to run it in there. I got some wind swirling around. I'm gonna try and take this one in low. If I can run it into the middle of the grain, I'm gonna be a very happy man. Giddy up, baby. Right, friend, see when you hit it that high, that high, wind doesn't, wind doesn't blow that high. You watch this, I'm gonna make the best par you've ever seen. Hardest hole on the golf course, make it look easy. All right, so people ask me all the time, how do you read a green? Imagine there was two or three feet of water on this green and you pull the plug, which way would it drain? In this case, it's gonna drain over to the left so I'm gonna aim this one a little out to the right. It's all about the water, folks. Oh, I didn't hit it. I'll take that though. I'll take four on four at Heritage every day of the week and twice on Sunday. Even through two, I'm feeling pretty good and it's only a matter of time before we start putting up some red numbers.